everyone welcome to another perfume haul video okay, so i was walking in the mall with my family when i noticed this shop um on the side that there were people like gathering in the front i think this is like a reject shop or something i'm not sure but they have they do have cheap um a lot of good um cheap stuff inside and then i saw um what catch my attention is like there was a lot of perfumes displayed in there and then there's like a big sign of two dollar each so as a perfume junkie myself i'll right away check in there and grab a bunch of these perfumes like i think these are knockoffs um clone perfumes at first i really thought like they are real although i'm already thinking like maybe they do are knockoff because there's no like two dollars on this uh, 35 mil especially this um, designer perfumes because even my sample perfume that's only two mil or three I had to pay like um, three to three dollar and this one is like two dollar I don't think you can tell they are authentic but still I continue um, getting them I want to see um, the difference I want to see how they perform and how they really are um, same as the original ones Okay, so first I'm gonna show you is C. It really looks like like the C, you know, the C Giorgio Armani. Though it didn't say um Giorgio Armani, it just says um C. Nothing else. Nothing else. It's in 35 mil, and this is how it looks like. I thought it's um a roller ball, but actually it has a spray nozzle, which is great because I don't like roller balls and i tried i actually tried this one already here and it does smells like the sea i have a sea sample perfume it, it does smell the same but the formulation i think is different because after like a few minutes maybe only 30 minutes or less it the the scent already slowly faded down like i cannot i can i can there's no more smell anymore so i think um, that's the big uh, difference. Of course, you will not expect this to perform same one as the original, but if you just want something to spray on, like next, I have here this um, Versage Bright Crystal. No, it's not Verse. It's like Birdcage, Birdcage. I don't know how do you, how you read it, but it's that it the the box, the print looks like. The Versace Bright Crystal. So I have the original one. This is the Versace Bright Crystal. And this is the one that I got. So they're almost the same. And this is the real bottle. So this is the real bottle. It has like a pinky um, liquid in there. And then this one, it also it's different. It has this, like a gradient pink in there. But the smell also like a clone exactly the same but again the formulation just won't i mean the scent just won't last i noticed they have maybe because it's more on alcohol it says here 80 percent alcohol parfum and aqua it's more basically just water alcohol and then <clears throat> the perfume so it, it doesn't last long then i have here um Cool Girl New York. It just says cool, cool Girl New York. And the scent is exactly the same as the Good Girl. Well, I'm happy to have this because I don't have um, Good Girl perfume. Though I, I smell it somewhere in the shop. But this one, I want to try this one before I buy. Um, the, if I like the scent, I will buy the um, the original good girl so i just think they're very they're very cute it's nice for fun but of course it's still um still good to have the original one than buying the knockoffs but i just think just for a try if you want to try the scent before you buy the original one though the lasting power is not really recommended it's just half an hour and this one is the bamboo so it's called bamboo and then they also have here um do duff it's called do duff cool water so this is how it looks it's like for men perfume so it's like knock off of the clone of the davidoff cool water for men 
and then they have here um it says jader jader luca bossi perfume jader so it, this also is this is also a clone for um jador look at the bottle it's also very gold i mean cute it has this golden um sprinkles here with a print gold and white cover so it also smells good they actually smells um really good the lasting power is just really it's just really bad and they have another one here some i'm not familiar with but some i'm familiar with the smell they have here the lady million but i don't own a lady million nor i'm not sure if i have the sample but i've smelled it from the shop it smells good yeah it also smells good just like the lady million so it just says lady million nothing else that's just the name and then they also have here um the men's fragrances actually really really smells nice they have here the sow vase it says the sow vase this is a clone for um salvage from your this one also is it smells really good i want to buy the real one and then they have this blue blue de chanel this blue de chanel so only the spelling is different because it's here it's chanel it's like blue de chanel and also the blue in chanel is the bleu this one is different but the smell is exactly the same if you have um smell the blue de chanel by chanel it's really the same one it's just a shame it won't last long it's just like buying this for a sample and then this one armani code men this is for men so my husband owned this perfume before so i know the scent this one also very sweet just the same same as it's really good and then i think it's only the top nose or i'm, I'm not sure only the uh, first spray is exactly the same scent but later on a few minutes it's slowly getting fade fade until it's gone for less than half an hour and then here i have um one million it just says one million here smells also good then i have i'm not gonna describe or go into detail all of them because they are just knock off of the original perfume so if you have smell i'd rather um review or describe the original one than this one and then i have here um white what is this it says luca bossi perfume there's an alligator there that would give you an idea like it's like lacoste and here is touch of pink so it does not have the name lacoste just touch of pink and this one here is just as white luca bossy perfume this one i tried this one it smells good so i'm not sure because i haven't smelled if there if there is a perfume that's touch of um pink by lacoste i don't know but this one smells <coughs> really nice and then this one is i feel like this is more um unisex it's fresh clean it's like a men's cologne and then they also have this um n5 this is also clone for chanel 5 it says um chamel paris n5 and as you can see the liquid <coughs> also same is like that and the scent yeah it's also same as chanel number five but this one reminds me of like a baby shampoo <clears throat> and then this one here is the oh this one i like this a lot it says bulkari here b u l C A R I Bulgari Alva Poor Home, but this I love the scent a lot. It's a men's cologne. I'm not sure if this is not off of a Bulgari perfume. I'm not sure which um Bulgari perfume is this um 
a clone of but this is really it really smells good i like it it's a cologne very fresh scent for a man it just says bulgari alva for home the brand is lovali lovali excellent but i like this a lot if there's an original version of this one from bulgari i want to try and then here i have um i'm not familiar with this um perfumes if they are knockoff of i'm not sure which knockoff perfume they are but this is called pink love this is the box very sweet um girly perfume and this one it has a flamingo in it it's called smile carefree by lovali so it has the same brand as this one as the bulkari it's also lovali and then i think the brands are lovali and luca bossi maybe that's the manufacturer or something very cute i can tell i can guess by the packaging that this is a very sweet girly fragrance yes it is it's it's very the straw there's a strawberry smell in it like a strawberry milkshake reminds me also of those um pen when we were in primary like those pen like smells a uh, red color pen that smells really good like strawberry it's this one i can give this to a kid or something you will like it plus the packaging is very cute this is a flamingo in there with butterfly it's so kitty and girly and then i have two more here it's called golden blossom i think this is also by lovali it has the same scent as the um blossom what perfume is that with uh, blossom no gucci gucci bloom it has the same smell as gucci bloom and then the last one is here Bo boost it's um boost hogo boost it's neo i don't know how to read it for femme also oh, this is for girls for women also by luca bossi I thought this is for um, it's a men's perfume. Looks like a men's. Um, I haven't tried this one. I cannot smell anything. Yeah, it's it's also nice. It's also good. I think like it's unisex. It could be for men or women. So because of the cover it's so dark i am expecting this to be a very a strong um serious mature smell but no it's like a cologne scent it could be for men or women i actually like it i'm not sure what um if there's an original version that they're trying to imitate this one it says um boost hugo boost so that's it that's, uh, that's what i have for today so just a disclaimer i am not trying to um advertise or encouraging people to buy knockoffs or something but just for fun i think they're they're really nice this one is good it's like sample perfume if you want to because they exactly smell the same um, as the original the, the designer ones so it's good if you want to test something some um, a perfume before you buy the real one but again it's still good to buy the original one it's worth the money so that's it for today's video i hope you enjoy it please like comment and subscribe for more videos